My name is Gonçalo dos Reis. I am a lecturer at the School of Mathematics. And my general interests are in probability and stochastic analysis, but then they range from all the connected fields like quantitative finance, statistics, numerics. Once I have this, this background from numerical analysis, it's, it's a natural step to look where are the applications and when you do stochastic analysis they will land automatically in financial mathematics, biology, applied physics. And then once you start looking at um, how can I engage with industry and you having this background from financial mathematics, it was a, a, a short step to go there figuring out what are the industries around and, and try to communicate and find connections. I enjoy the work with industry because you go and you talk with people that have really concrete problems. Companies are accountable to the, to the banking regulator and they have to show that they're using best practices, that the mathematics they use is sound, robust and it has a real um, life impact because it's about managing risk, there's an engagement with the European regulator for banks, so it's social work in the sense that what you do has impact throughout the whole industry. None of the projects I worked on would have been possible without um, Edinburgh Research and Innovation. Um, they helped us plot through all the legality and contracts that we, as as a mathematician working for the first time with, a, with, a, with an industry partner, I had no idea about the scope of um, what is allowed and not allowed, how many rights are we um, giving or not, and how do we protect ourselves against you know, copyright and all these kinds of things, licensing, and th this we had not known. ERI has networking events on which you can participate, so you can suggest people to be invited and coming, and you go and participate in the network, you get referrals, you talk ideas, and the connection, you get an idea of another direction to explore. ERI helped us to stand on a much higher platform of knowledge and experience that we would not have had had we not engaged with ERI. And I think this was, this was, this was fundamental. I have had uh, two collaborations with, with industry supported by the Impact Acceleration Fund, so one of them with a financial services company called Moody's Analytics here in Edinburgh. For the second project, we engage with a bank in London. The um, Impact Acceleration Funds allowed exactly that. One of the mathematical problems we had, it was solved within three days by finding someone that knew, th that knew the, the mathematics, inviting the person to come to Edinburgh, and within the week of the person being here, the problem was solved. And it's exactly this flexibility in terms of, of the funding that really allowed the research to move on. And then, for instance, it would have been impossible to go to London so often, so once a month you have, you pick up the bags and you bring the whole team to London, you stay at the offices for three days and you discuss and co-create methodologies that fit the, the bank's requirements and that we can, and are also feasible from the mathematical perspective. In the end, the project was, was successful. And for instance, the, several of the current outcomes mean the companies are now engaging successfully with our research, with the financial regulator. We're working so that our new algorithms are now part of the library from the regulator itself. And we're making contributions that are useful for all banks in how they can measure risk and so on. And these are fundamental things that affect everyone.